This is a very, very rare scene in the Buckley kitchen. It's Mr. Buckley clearing up. Take it in guys, take it in. Let me know in the comments if you've ever seen this before in the two years we've been doing this. Hey guys, welcome to this week's vlog. <laughs> Hope you're well. Hope you're all good. How are you? What's going on? You all right? Are you sure? I need coffee. Sunday, bank holiday Sunday. Bank holiday Sunday, might as well be Saturday. Might as well, free day. Uh, what are we doing today, Claire? I do need to get tidied up today because we got old J and C coming over. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not J C, J and C. Ah. We got John and Claire coming over later on this evening. This clean. It's just water from hard boiling eggs, so it basically is clean. Just needs a wipe. Clean enough for me. I need to wipe these sides down for mock it. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? That's bathroom cleaner. What are you doing? I was just going to wipe down the sides. I'm about to do that. I was waiting for you to get out my road. That's not it either. That's not it. That's not the surface. A shower. Can you get out the road and I'll do it? Alright. What, what, what do you want? Because I've been... You have a go at me if I don't do it. I've been waiting you start having a go at me it. when I'm doing I've stuff. I've been waiting to do it and you're in there pulling out. Because look, look at the mess now. You pulled out everything except the it one looks, bottle you need. It, Claire, everything I pulled out, I put it exactly back where it was. No, you never. It's a mess. No, you never. You got a shower? I'm going to, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have a shower. Just checking, I know you. Yeah, I've been very busy lately. Making a TV show. I did another little TV appearance thing last week, sort of panel show type thing, and uh, filming a pilot this week. Are you? Yeah, on Thursday. For what? Oh, that... Yeah. Filming a pilot for some something which I think could be quite fun, but... I didn't know that. Yeah, I'm shooting that on Thursday. But, um... My track record with making pilots and stuff is, is really bad. There's been a lot of pilots, not a lot of shows. There's been, there's been a lot of pilots made <laughs> that have never seen a light of day. You're busy. Sort of getting back on the horse again. The acting train. Getting back on it, yeah. Seeing if I can revive my television career. It's difficult though. It's hard. <laughs> Just when we start yeah, a YouTube right. career, you decide you want to get yeah. back on telly. No, I'll do it. we can do it all. We can have it all. Listen, it's fine. The acting's going. We both know the acting's going nowhere. Just let me indulge. Just indulge me. Okay. But it is, you know. I don't think I get enough credit. For what? No. For the, for the acting career I've had so far. James, you were in one program. I know, and I can't even act, and yet look at me. Do you know how difficult it is to act in something when, you, when you've got not, no talent? <laughs> Look at him there, he can't even act, but he's still doing stuff. Hello, just quickly interrupting to talk about this week's sponsor, which is none other than Hello Fresh. Um, I'm about to make dinner for me and the boys. James is at work, so I'm gonna get cracking because we've got a lot of homework to do tonight. Okay, you guys know about Hello Fresh, you know that we use Hello Fresh. Um, it's fast, it's easy, it makes dinner times a lot easier for me because um, I'm the one who cooks. Um, although James is actually alright at doing dinner when it's a HelloFresh box because it's an idiot's guide. <laughs> you can pick family ones, you can pick healthy ones, you can pick fast meals which usually I tend to go for either family or fast because you know, the one I'm making tonight is herby pork ragu. So it's basically a sort of bolognese thing, which goes down well with the kids every time. If you want to get involved, there is a link in the description. Use the code thebuckleys60 
and you'll get 60% off your first box and 25% off your next eight boxes, which is pretty, pretty good. Now, like I said, it's a fool's guide. Everything's in your bag, everything's labeled. Your cards come numbered and it gives you step by step on the other side. So, let's get cracking. Cause she, she really goes for it sometimes. If you put them in here, James, it smells so bad in here. You want to see what I bought? Yeah. Some sequins there. Jesus Christ. Nice. I had to order a couple of new summery bits. Yeah. How cool is that? Look at the way that down the workman's club. <laughs> no, you're going to take me somewhere. But I thought wear well, that with like a Beatles t-shirt. Nah, that's cool. That's cool AF. Stings, doesn't it? It does. Why did you? You know, that was the thing we had to try Chocolate. so hard with the scummy t shirts. Yeah. Every time we would get. Oh, that really does kick up. Every time we would get samples in, the t shirts would stink. That's and we sort were of like, we're not. Glue. Yeah, and we kept saying, we don't want that. That's horrible opening up yeah. something that you want to wear knowing. You have to wash it first. Is that is it? You don't want someone opening up your product and the first thing they go, well, that stinks. <laughs> no. Literally the opposite of the of what you want. Too short. Who's too short? You. For this? Yeah. Oh, we're heels. No, but I think. My boobs won't fit in it. This is probably what's gonna happen. I think you'll like this. It's leather. You have a bit of a leather fetish. Do you? <laughs> it's sexy though, isn't it? Like, the, of all the... It's not real leather, is it? No. no. Of all the... Um, ah, ah, ah. Of all the fabrics. I thought that was quite cool. Yeah. But at that, yeah. in it. All the fabrics, leather's the uh, sexiest. The sexiest, okay. I love this. This is probably my favourite. What do I say is the least sexy food? Pickled eggs. Pickled eggs, yeah. <laughs> I love a pickled egg. So leather is the opposite of that. Leather's the vindaloo Leather's of, of fabric. Yeah, hot and spicy. <laughs> and this is just a little dress to chuck on the likes of today. A see through. Mm. That's the second sexiest fabric. A see through. Yeah. While the camera's rolling, mm. I've got something to tell you. Oh, Christ. You kind of get mad at me because the camera's rolling. Go on. I bought myself a pair of expensive shoes. Oh yeah? Yeah. Really expensive. What'd you get? Versace. Oh really? Yeah. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. No, I like. <coughs> yeah. That's fine. You spend a lot more than me. On what? Trainers, clothes, Fred Perry, Pret there's always parcels coming for you. This Not to mention difference. your Amazon stuff, which is just constant. This is the difference though. I know you're always saying I'm always buying Hold on stuff. a minute. Don't you tell me that like three, four things for Fred Perry and Pretty Green doesn't add up to four or five hundred quid easily. Three hundred, three hundred and fifty. Yes. 
I'm not having a go at you. I feel like you're having a go at me. You've no, got some expensive shoes and now I'm being had a go at. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. Just saying. I didn't even say anything. You're like, hang on a minute. No, no, no. no. You, <laughs> I've just said you buy me than me. Fact. Yeah, but I buy 60 pound trainers. I'm hoping to get a couple of suits in the week. Yeah. I'll take the guys along with me. Well, that's the difference between me and you. I have to buy my stuff. Well, yeah, I was asked if I wanted some suits. Mm. And I, I need some. I mean, I've been trying to, I've been, you know I've been trying to sort out a yeah. couple of nice suits. You only need one suit. Court and funeral. Is it? Right, I'm going to go and get changed. I don't feel comfortable. No? No. What are you going to wear? I don't know. And just like that, we're ready to host. <laughs> uh, Sunday evening, John and Claire will be here <sighs> any minute now. House looks good. We look good. Again, downstairs looks good. Upstairs. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Upstairs, don't worry about it. Upstairs is a shit tape. I need to put some meetings in. The upstairs of our house is how sort of young people, like, that go on a lad's holiday or something, treat their hotel room. Yeah. They're just there, it's just there sleeping. <laughs> no, we're spending the time there. I mean, I'll Just chuck some clothes on the floor, get ready, hey, we're going out. These good people know. The upstairs was clean last week. Mm. That's how long it lasts. It's a mess now. Oh. <sighs> James is rocking some flares again. I'm looking pretty good. Even Although I've, 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 not, I've not ironed my t-shirt, which I should have done. No, I'm looking, what, am I not looking, am oh I not looking my good? Oh god, honestly. You can't. This man, in his need to be told how good looking he is all the time. I don't need to be told how good looking I am. You're just, constantly you're saying just, that. You're, you're constantly just, like, I look really good. Don't you think I look good, Claire? Yeah, what does that tell you? I don't know, you don't tell me I look good. I don't always give a sh always telling you how good you look. Not always. Constantly telling you how good you look. When was the last time you ever paid me a compliment? Oh. Just say. I'm not really a person who gives out compliments. I don't compliment anybody. No. I don't want compliments. That's fine. And I don't need to give them to people. That's fine. Just makes me uncomfortable talking like that. That's weird. Being able to, you know, be nice to people. <laughs> I'm nice to people. I just don't, it's just, it's when it gets a bit overly. My dad's like that though. I've kind of got my dad that I, yeah. I feel a bit uncomfortable with yeah, certain interactions. Know, you know what misery guts he is. <laughs> Getting off a brave there. Well, I won't be on the camera, obviously. <laughs> right, I need to pee. <laughs> Did you hear the camera turning on, Paisley? Hard life, him. Because you took her out a walk today, she's knackered. I was the first person to sit on this chair today. Let me sit down, I'm old. You're ancient. Right, well. Oh! You okay, Claire? Oh, I've chipped the glass. You've chipped a glass. Uh, it's the end of the evening, and what happened, what I assumed would happen, did happen. Uh, we didn't pick up the vlog camera, but you didn't miss out much. <laughs> it's 11pm. It's not even that late, is it? Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Really, like, this is the, the 11 o'clock. Perfect time to just sort of go, should we go to bed now? Yeah, sure. Monday tomorrow, but no work, no school. No. I mean, I say no work, I'll need to start editing this. Oh, no! no. Claire, that's out of order. That's not funny. That, no, that does smell. Oh, great. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. That's James. This is why it, it's not funny when you do it. You clean it out of room. Yeah. Made it into uh, into central here. Uh, just got on the uh, the Elizabeth line. The first time I've ever been on it. Probably the nicest tube train, underground train I've ever been on. Well, nice. I saw all over the place. It was great. I'd recommend it. 
No, I'm not 100% sure where I'm going. Uh, but apparently I'm about a minute's walk away from where I need to be. Yeah, it's nice. It, no it, so. You're looking snazzy. Yeah. This is a really nice fit. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's just... <laughs> it's just that bit that I struggle with. Breathe in. <laughs> the thing is that... the breathe in. Nine times out of ten, you probably won't do it up, but... It's nice to have Getting into this now. Yeah, it's quite exciting. Thinks it's the bee's knees now. <laughs> Very, it's definitely a very different look. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think it's nice. It's very sort of Doctor No. Doctor Who? Doctor No. Who's that? Sean Connery. Oh, right, okay. James Bond. Yeah. yeah. With the waistcoat. I like think, it? I really like it. Yeah. Okay, where are we, Robin? We are at an Aqua, Aqua Rooftop Bar. Aqua Rooftop yeah, Bar. I think that's what it's called. Yeah. But that was nice, wasn't it? Yeah. Ted Baker. Mm -hmm. hooking, very kind. Hooking me up. Yeah. That's, uh, that's what the kids say, don't they? Yeah. Thanks for hooking me up. Yeah. We've just popped in here for a quick drink. Yeah. You've got a meeting. Mm -hmm. Should I try and get you drunk for your meeting? Well, you've got an hour, so that would be... Yeah, so you're going to have to really... I'm going to buy you five drinks right now. <laughs> It's a Tuesday afternoon. If, um, if Robin's like slurring her words and stuff <laughs> during, zip, yeah. during this important meeting, oh, it's because of this. I've gone for a classic mojito. It's one of my favourite cocktails. Absolutely love mojito. Oh, it's good to be James Buckley. <laughs> Morning. Just let Paisley out for our morning pee. Almost half seven in the morning. I've got the boys in the living room to get them up for school. This is for Jude. Harris is not really a big eater in the morning. Uh, sometimes he will, sometimes he won't. This morning he doesn't want anything. Usually I can cook some to have something before he leaves, so we'll see. Not 
clothes. Right, pack lunches are made, the boys are dressed, just about time to go. And that's when Big Daddy Bucks shows his face. You're not working today, are you? Not filming today? Not filming today, no. So, you're doing the school run? Yeah. Alright, go and take my babies to school. Alright. I'll see you when you get back. Yeah, um... I was trying to think, I was trying to think of a joke. Come on James, come on, this has been a boring vlog. Come on, walk out in style, go on, say something funny. Go on. Uh, where's my hat, my wooly hat? <laughs> I don't know. This was quite funny, look what came in the post uh, the other day. It says it right on the packet. Anus all wipes. That was quite embarrassing for you, wasn't it? What? When your anus all wipes turned up with anus all wipes written oh, no, on the box. That's really out of order. <laughs> like, that's really out of order. By the way, I've not got piles. Although, as you know, I don't, I don't care about letting you know. <laughs> but this is preventative. So even if you don't have piles, get yourself a flushable medicinal wet wipe. Don't use... Here it goes again. Don't use scented ones. Don't ever use scented flushable wet wipes. The, the, the anus is very sensitive to the skin. Yeah, we know, James. We know, Matt. <coughs> right, go and take my kids to school. I'll we'll right. see you when you get back. to drink my coffee, get my joggers on, no she's drinking, get my joggers on, take Miss Paisley for a walk and then get back and start editing this video.